Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is made in partnership with H2O Plus and I'm gonna be sharing how I prep my skin using their hydration sensitive system. First up, I'm using the H2O Plus Gel Cleanser and this is perfect for sensitive skin if you have any signs of redness, discomfort, or dryness. First, I lather it in my hands and then I massage it into my skin. Afterwards, I rinse with lukewarm water and pat dry. After cleansing, I use the Hydration Sensitive Essence and I just splash a quarter size amount onto my palm and then I press it evenly into my skin. I love this essence, it has a very silky texture and it prepares your skin to receive the maximum benefits of the serum and moisturizer we'll be applying next. Here is the H2O Plus Hydration Sensitive Milk Serum. This is a clean, lightweight, milky serum, and it's going to help relieve sensitive skin by providing essential hydration. I use about one to two pumps, and I gently press that onto the face and neck. Lastly, I'm using the Gel Cream Moisturizer, and I'm just massaging that gently into the skin. If you guys are interested in trying out this collection, I will leave a link below for you in the description box. Now on to makeup, I am using the VDL Satin Veil Primer. And after I press that into the skin, I'm using the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer, and this is the illuminating one. It has SPF 30 in it, which is perfect, and I just apply that all over the face. I have some green discoloration underneath the eyes, so I'm just going to use this flesh color corrector. It's a very salmon-y shade, and I'm applying that in all the areas that need a little bit of help. <laughs> Next, I'm going in with concealer. This one is by Makeup Forever, and I'm basically just applying that on top of the color corrector after I've let it set for a little bit. Now I'm just powdering the face with the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. For contour, I'm using this Bare Mineral shade. It's a very cool tone brown, and I'm applying that to the hollows of my cheeks and the perimeter of my face. Next up, I'm using my favorite bronzer. You guys see this all the time. It's the Marc Jacobs Omega Bronze, and I believe the shade is Tantric, and I'm just applying that almost as a blush because it's a very orange bronzer. Next up, I'm using another bronzer, and I'm applying this as an eyeshadow. This one is a very deep and very orange kind of color, and it's by Fenty Beauty. Next, I'm doing a wing, so whenever I do wings, I like to outline the shape first in a black eyeshadow, and then I use an actual felt liner or gel liner to just fill everything in. Every time I see this highlighter, I die a little bit. It's just so beautiful. This is the Laura Mercier Face Illuminator, and the shade is Indiscretion. Then I'm using this Fenty Beauty lipstick, and the shade is Unveil. And that is the finished look. I hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I will see you very soon in the next one.